I love you know the, the people of Sunderland. You know they're my favourite people. I mean they're the best people, and it's something which you know the football club. We I've always got something in common with those. With you know with the people of Sunderland, and special people, and I get them and they get me. You know, we're Sunderland fans. We're on the same the same wavelength. Yeah, it's, it's it's just nicer as a Sunderland fan. You know we can actually watch a Netflix show and kind of enjoy it, which has um, been, you know, anticipated for a few years now. So just those first two series are brutal. And, I, and we, you know, it's punishing to watch as a, as a fan of the club, but we still watched it. You know, it's, um, it's part of being a Sunderland fan and it allowed the world to see what it was like to be a Sunderland fan. And we still have those moments, you know, so we're not, we're not back to the big time yet. And we're not where we should be as a club, but we're getting there one stage at a time. And obviously, you know, Wembley beating Wickham, Massive day for the club. You know, one of my best days as a Sunderland fan. And yeah, I was. Uh, I had a few beers beforehand, but yeah, it was Sunday. I tell you. What's your views on things currently? Yeah, it's the views at the minute. I mean, it's it's hit and miss. I mean, we. I was sad to see Mowbray go personally because you know I loved him. I thought I thought he was a good manager. Um, there's always opinions for different fans. You know, the style of football we play. That's you know that's going to be with any fans at any football club but yeah you obviously want to see an attractive style being played but you want to be winning games that's the main thing you know results are, are what matters at a football club they what matters to the fans and stuff and it's you know it's been tough but yeah we want to get out of the championship soon and hopefully when the time's right we will and um and then yeah stay in the premier league for a few seasons that'd be a good plan one it's good. I've made. I've got so many friends in Sunderland. It's like, yeah, you know, when I'm going to, I'm going to Birmingham on Saturday, and I'm going with Tom White. And like, we're friends through TV, but through Sunderland, really. You know, I first met him when we were, well, three or four years ago. You know, it, you know, some away games and stuff. And I think for me, it's just, I love, I love, you know, the, the people of Sunderland. You know, they're my favourite people. I mean, they're the best people, and it's something which. You know the football club. We, I've always got something in common with those. With, you know, with the people of Sunderland, and special people, and I get them and they get me. You know, we're Sunderland fans. We're on the same the same wavelength. It's not easy to be a Sunderland fan. And but coming up here, you know, and seeing the boys and stuff. I chatted to my mate today. Who, you know, born and bred, lives in Sunderland, and I won't. I miss him this time because I used to fly and visit in and out. But. Yeah, I just love, you know, I love the city and I love the people and you just want to see the happiness on everyone's faces, don't we? We want to be back in the Prem and hopefully we can.